I'm in Quebec, in North America, on the hunt for one of the most delicious birds in the world, the snow goose. Almost a million descend on the St. Lawrence River for a few weeks each year. So far, I'd had little luck shooting one. A new day, and Daniel takes me to a new hunting spot, this time, thankfully, on dry land. So why didn't you bring me here yesterday in a nice little sort of bunker than being sat in the middle of a river? S sometimes it's better there, sometimes it's better here. It feels right here. Yeah, anyway, we're, uh, we're well placed. And it's getting nice and white over there, isn't it? Yeah, they're beginning to be maybe two or 3,000 now. So when they fly over, I can shoot anyone? Or... If you want to eat it, yeah. the grey ones are much more better right. because they are more tender. Because they're uh, the youngsters. Exactly. Yeah. We've just made it 10 times more difficult, so it's not just about shooting a snow geese. No. It's looking exactly. for the grey ones. Exactly. Young grey geese have migrated fewer miles than older birds, so the meat is more tender. <coughs> it isn't long before we get our first chance. Wait, wait, wait. Shoot! <laughs> Miss it, but not bad. Order will come. They're looking good, these ones here. Ready? Yep. Shoot! Yeah. Aiming for a stray goose on the move is the best way to ensure we hit just one with a clean shot. And finally, one came our way. Oh, shoot, Gordon. Yes! Yes! Shit! Woo! I'd got my goose, but was it the right age and the very best to eat? Brilliant. Huh? Perfect. Hey, young one? Beautiful one, young one. My God, look at that baby there. Well, wow. <laughs> and how young is that? Is that the perfect age? It's a, it's a, a fresh, oh, yeah. fresh new goose of the, of the year. Honestly, I'm so pleased to get one. That's brilliant. Finally, we got one. <laughs> Finally. Uh, we got it. Excellent. <laughs> well done. <laughs> <clears throat> Beautiful woods. Yeah. Huh? Before I can cook snow goose for the first time, Daniel shows me how to debreast the bird. Now, to get the breasts off, you just have to pull like that. And see, everything is coming. That's incredible. And look how thin that fat is. There's hardly any fat on there. A lot darker than I expected. Yeah, it's like a red-brown meat. Yeah, yeah, like venison. And the breasts are quite thick as well. I thought, yeah. it'd, be, I thought they'd be thin. Close, but... close to, uh, to an inch, yeah. It's incredible.